Hey guys, Assassin's Creed Syndicate recently got its 1.31 update on PC and there is a way you can finally unlock the 30 frames per second cloth physics cap that's put into the game. Now I'm going to link this article in my video description so you can check out if you want. Besides, DSO Gaming is a wonderful PC gaming site that I would definitely give a look if you're into PC gaming. Now I'm going to show you how easy it is to do this. However, I think that Ubisoft should have put this option in the game anyway, so you shouldn't have to manually put this in. But basically, you want to copy the physics motion simulation FPS equals 1. You want to copy that. Now, I'm on Windows 10. But this will work just as easy on Windows 7, 8, 8.1. Or any operating system that will run Assassin's Creed Syndicate. I don't even know what the minimum is. But basically, you want to go to your documents. Assassin's Creed Syndicate will have its own folder. You want to go to ACINI, double click. Now what I do is, I go to the options. I make my own space for it, paste it, then I get out, save, now you go, hit play, and let Assassin's Creed load as usual. But like I said, it would have been nice to see Ubisoft put this in the actual PC gaming options menu instead of us having to do this the old fashioned way, going into an INI file, you know. But at least it can be unlocked, so I'm not going to about that aspect it just would have been nice that this would have been put into the options anyways so we can continue and already you can see the cloth is actually moving a lot smoother now it's actually moving now. Doesn't feel like it's stuttering when you're moving. But this also not only does it affect your main character you play in the game, it affects NPCs as well. So their cloth is actually moving not at 30 frames per second. And as you can see it feels it looks a lot smoother now when you move it doesn't feel like you're stuttering as you're moving so that's a plus. Well I think we're gonna wrap up the video with that hopefully this makes your gaming a lot smoother now so you don't have that annoying cap at 30 frames per second when the rest of your game is running at 60 or above. Alright, well happy PC gaming, laters.